Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add a keyboard shortcut to a folder so that way you could uh, just type in this quick keyboard shortcut and open the folder from wherever you are. You don't have to browse to it or find the icon or shortcut, that kind of thing. So the first step is you need to create a shortcut to the folder because you can't assign it to the folder. So we have this common files folder here. So we need to first create a shortcut. So we could do that a couple of ways. We could copy it. And then put it in, you know, right click, paste shortcut. We could also right click and then send to desktop as shortcut, either way. So now we have our shortcut there. So inside this folder, so we have the same files as we do right here in the real version. So we're going to right click the uh, folder, go to properties, and on the shortcut tab, see it says no shortcut key. So Whatever you do, it's going to have to do, so if I type in control, let's say, it's going to want to put control alt no matter what you do. So if I type in an S, it puts control alt in front of it. So I'm going to do, let's say, F for favorite. So control alt F, that's going to be my shortcut. Hit apply, and then OK. So now let's say, you know, you've got edge open, you got some stuff you're working on, blah, blah, blah. So if I do... Control Alt F. It pops up my folder. It takes a second. It's not super instant for some reason. I'm not sure why, but that's one of the glitches. So I didn't have to click on anything. I didn't have to find the folder. And let's say you didn't want to even see your shortcut here. You want to keep it clean. You could right click it, go to properties, general tab, mark it as hidden. And now it's gone. It's still there. It's just hidden. So now if I do Control Alt F again, There it is, and then under my documents, I still have the original file, so simple as that. So one catch for a hidden file, so if you have the option under view to show hidden items, it's going to show there, it's just going to be a little grayed out, so you won't be able to hide it if you have the uh, show hidden items uh, view there. So once again, find your folder, create your shortcut, go to your shortcut, properties, and under the shortcut tab, Pick a shortcut key, so you're pretty much just typing in a letter and it'll put Control Alt in front of it. And then I'll click OK, and then all you gotta do is press that uh, shortcut wherever you're at, and it'll open up your favorite folder. Alright, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.